Well, tonight a local school is celebrating the end of almost a century of memories. After almost 90 years, the chief mascot for Goshen High School is retired. WSBT 22's Hillary Powell is here with us. She was there when friends and family gathered to say a special goodbye. That's right, Bob. The school's Redskins are now the Red Hawks. That change happened January 1st after a lengthy debate and voting process. Fans and alumni moved into the future with an open house that look at the past to move into the present. Sunlight hits faded memories one more time. Deccan said they were from the 70s. Some that haven't seen light in nearly 90 years. First we can find is 1927, where he's first in basketball. The other sports, it didn't come till later, maybe 10 years later. So it's lasted quite a while. Dale Garber is curator at Goshen Museum. He came out Saturday night to see the stitched face of the chief. I like some of the uh, uniforms with the different chief uh, decorations or the um, portraits of them. They're, they're all a little bit different. It was one more chance to spot an old photo and remember the days when Goshen High School was home to the Redskins. I think to show the respect for the, the school and what they remember. I think everybody remembers the good times, maybe more than what the bad times were. And the Redskins is a good time. That's cool. Good times, but not for some. The mascot is now the Red Hawks after Native Americans found it offensive. The change marks the end of an era and a break from tradition. Because um, my parents were both Redskins, and when I grow up, I wanted to be one, so. Tonight, the memories have a permanent spotlight instead of fading into the shadows. It's supporting it because I really wanted to keep it and I didn't want it to go away. The memorabilia on display was all donated to the Goshen Museum. The school's head coaches voted unanimously to induct the chief into the sports wall of fame. That's where the statue of him now stands.